Hello, and welcome to Fanshawe International's guide on how to use WebDivisor. Today we'll be going over how to log in and utilize the WebDivisor platform. So we're just going to go to Google, and we're going to Google Fanshawe WebAdvisor, and then you're just going to click on the first link, and then scroll down and click on Login to WebAdvisor. We're then going to go up here to log in, and with your username and password that you have for the Wi-Fi or for Fanshawe Online, you're just going to log in. Now, if you don't have this information, you can go to our help desk in E2030 or visit our Welcome Center in the F building, and they'll be more than happy to help you with this information. So next, we'll click on Students, and you'll see a whole list of options here. Uh, the most important of this is going to be Demographic Update over here. So what Demographic Update is, is it's going to be a list of all your information, and uh, this is very important for the college to have because you need a Canadian address listed here so that the school has a place to contact and send you things. So we'll just click on here. So after you've clicked on Demographic Update, you'll be taken to this page. Uh, now it's very important that once you have your Canadian address that you listed here, uh, typically your old information uh, from your home country will be listed in this spot. So just go ahead and uh, delete that information and put in your street address, uh, your postal code, and any phone number with which the college can contact you. Now, don't change your email address. Uh, this is the email address for Fanta Online, so just leave that as normal. Uh, lastly, you're going to want to make sure you have an emergency contact name and phone number listed here, as well as the relationship to maybe a parent, sibling, or a friend. Um, this is just so uh, in case anything happens to you at your time at Fanshawe, there is somebody that can be contacted uh, to let them know what has happened. Once you have filled out all this information, you can just go down here to Submit, and that will save all the information for you. So once your information has been saved, you'll be returned to this main page here, and if you can't find this page, just go up here to Student Menu, click on that, and it will return you here. Now, because you've only just begun your setting at Fanta, um, a lot of this information will not be prevalent to you right away. Um, eventually, as you progress through the years, uh, you'll need this information more and more, such as gen ed courses down here, or your tax information up here, but we're mainly just going to focus on things that will be beneficial to you in your first year. Uh, so the next thing we're going to check out is the class schedule, uh, and click on it for grid layout. Now, down here in options, there are a lot of options. It, it seems really long and ridiculous, but mainly we're just going to stick with winter, uh, which would be January through to the end of April, fall, which is September through to December, and summer, which is May through to August. So click on whichever one of these buttons suits your needs at the moment. Click on that, and then just click Submit. Here, we can see an awesome little graph that gives you all the information of your courses. So it's going to list what building your course is in and the course code. Uh, this can let you know what books you need. And uh, at the bottom, you can also find out what teachers you have for each course. So then we'll just go back up to Student Menu, and it'll take us back to our main page. So the last two things we'll look at quickly are our View Grades. So just go up here, click View Grades. You could then go into each semester that you have and find out your grades for that term. Just simply click one, click Submit, and that'll take you right into it. And then lastly, we'll just go to our transcript. So here in our transcript button, you can go in here, click the type of transcript you want, either or, click Submit, and it will give you all the grades that you have earned at Fanshawe College. Okay, so WebAdvisor is a big platform. There's a lot of information here, but this should get you started on the basics. Again, if you need any more help, please visit our help desk in E2030 or visit the Welcome Center in F Building, and they'll be happy to give you more information on all of this stuff. Hopefully this video was helpful. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more videos like this.